Hi, this is Dr. Amrita and uh, today on Health Well Bridge, I am going to talk about two online coding classes uh, my daughter took, one with White Hat Junior and another with Avishkar India platform. Everywhere and everyone is advertising coding classes and the onslaught of the advertisement will make all parents feel that you need to get your child started with the coding, right? Like that's what happened with me. When the lockdown started, we took one class, actually two classes with Avishkar India platform and then we found White Hat Junior. Now, the main part of this video will be about White Hat Junior and our experience with it and a little bit about what uh, Avishkar India was all about. Uh, the main question is, is White Hat Junior worth it? Can your child learn coding with it and whether your child is going to have fun with it and is it worth all the hype and the money? This is not sponsored in any way and this is a review of a parent who has used it, paid money for it and wanted to see what it was all about. First thing first, White Hat Junior definitely has its marketing A game on. Like you will find all the A-list stars, the movie stars promoting it right now. But the question is how many of them actually studied coding and whether they are the people who, who, whose recommendation for education you should be taking seriously. That's one very important thing. I don't know where they get this idea that uh, film stars promoting anything and everything is totally okay. Because right now with everything going on, I wouldn't trust any platform which has film stars advertising education in any form. That's my thing. Luckily for most parents, uh, White Hat Junior actually does make coding very interesting. Uh, the first class is totally free. You don't have to put in any kind of credit card information or account information to get your child started with the coding classes. It is very easy to sign up and they will give you a link where you can join and you can choose uh, when to get your child started with the class. It is very easy and the child will definitely enjoy it because the format is very playful. It is easy to understand and they have good teachers. At least uh, the teacher we had was very good and uh, my daughter enjoyed it. And then we signed up first for the eight class package and then for a 16 class package, which was almost for four months. Now, these are the very good things. Uh, first things first, again, uh, they offer certificates after the first free class and after the eighth class. But uh, then I was told that you get a certificate only after finishing the 48 classes. Now, that 48 classes is a 1 lakh package, which we were not comfortable paying forward because by that time I had had enough of their cold calling and repeated uh, focus on the child making an app and selling it and starting a business and being the next, I don't know, Bill Gates and Mark Zuckerberg, whatever. So that was very upsetting and a little bit of the kind of propaganda I don't want my child to undergo while learning something. Now, what are the pros of White Hat Junior? But if before I come to that, I will tell you what you must have. A laptop, it's a must have and a high speed internet connection. That's very important. Definitely see when the child is uh, taking the classes. It's better that uh, this kind of online education is supervised by an adult. Now, what was really good about White Hat Junior? The dashboard is fun. They give hats for punctuality, creativity and all sorts which the children really enjoy. The teachers are very good, interactive. They have good homeworks which the child is supposed to submit. The homework is checked by the teacher. If the child has some problem, they get some help. Uh, you can connect with the teacher over chat. And uh, they also have several competitions going on. And the dashboard shows the scores of all the different coders uh, enrolled in the course at that time. That's good and a kind of problematic, especially for young kids who get into the mode of gaming and unnecessary competition about something which is supposed to be fun. Uh, and uh, since the age group is not uniform and the experience of the kids with coding is also not uniform, that kind of a dashboard can give a little bit of, you know, FOMO type thing where the child and the parents are feeling, okay, my child is not able to match up to this. Since my daughter was only eight, I was not worried about the scores and everything, but uh, she used to enjoy looking at the scoreboard. 
and tried to submit the homework on time which was always very good because I like to see her doing the homework and the assignment works given on time and all those formats was very easy to do there was no difficulty but uh, the cons again had to be highlighted because uh, it's not all hunky dory and for a very steep price uh, I think Whitehead Junior needs to step up its game uh, it's quite steeply priced at uh, 6,299 rupees for 8 classes and then you have a f around, uh, they have different packages and they have a 44 class package of around 35,000 something and the price points keep changing, they give a lots of discount and there's a lot of marketing going around and if you have coupon codes you might have a lower price point but the entire class thing, like if you want to up for all the classes and the app development and everything, it comes to almost more, that's definitely more than 1 lakh which we didn't do we took only 16 classes and after that we decided to take a break because uh, honestly uh, they had two kinds of people who will call you up marketing people and coordinator and both of them will not be able to help you with the queries you have i also had a query about the certificates not arriving on time and uh, thing about the name of my daughter which i had to remind multiple times before i could get it done almost at the end of the course curriculum and uh, the certificate we received after the lockdown was over and online and also offline the online certificate we received as soon as the course was completed and the real certificate arrived by mail all those was fine what was not fine was uh, while they were trying to encourage children to code that is all very well they keep on harping about the child going to silicon valley the child being the next big app developer who is going to earn crores so that kind of marketing is very uncomfortable and that's what I actually gave a feedback to the chatbots which were available on the dashboard where uh, apparently the CEO at that time was asking the parents for the feedback if they had any problem but I never uh, you know heard back from him after that and then I heard it was bought by Baiju's and the marketing just reached the next level and uh, then I thought about writing my experience with uh, Whitehead Junior because I felt uh, parents face a lot of pressure when they see other parents you know talk about coding for their kids and what their kids should learn and how it's good for them to learn coding and everything which I totally agree with it's going to be a uh, important skill to learn very important I even like uh, we actually together tried to learn scratch using books and online tutorials and everything and Whitehead Junior did play a part in that but whether those skills are going to be useful for further coding experiences later in life will only be visible later in time. The main problem is they do not actually teach children how to do coding independently and that's I think a big problem because once you come out of the classes it's not that the child will be able to just go and do something by themselves until and unless there's a proper framework like you teach ABC then you teach small words three letter words then you teach them how to write sentences and then you teach them how to write stories that way can you reschedule the classes that Whitehead Junior is you know you have allotted the rescheduling is tough and it is not explained anywhere upfront on the website at least it was not there when we uh, took the classes uh, you have to reschedule at least 24 hours in advance or you lose the class credit in case the teacher is running late or they have server issues they do not replace the time loss that was very weird even though I repeatedly asked no response on that part and uh, during the class if there are server issues you will have to call up the teacher directly because if you call up the helpline number they generally don't have any answers so the service side of Whitehead Junior didn't really make me very happy secondly the platform provides fun activities for coding but does not actually teach children how to code as a skill you know uh, we'll have to see how much further children need to learn before they can code independently without supervision because just 16 classes or 4 months will not be enough for my child so that's why I am still looking for other platforms so we did take a class with Avishkar India platform uh, they had a package going at that time and uh, even in that there was like uh, 
students from different age groups from 8 to 14, 15 and they were all at different levels of coding and definitely the exercises were not uh, fit for younger kids who had little coding experience. So this is mostly. So before you go for White Hat Junior, you will have to see what you want your child to do. Like if you are focused on them being the biggest app developer in the history of India and earning you crores before they turn 13, then uh, that's up to you. But uh, it's too much pressure on little kids and it definitely focuses on the gaming mentality and then it's a little like, you know, uh, a lot of pressure on them. Coding is supposed to be fun, it's supposed to be creative, it's supposed to encourage design thinking and it's a wonderful mix of, you know, the STEM education part and creative thinking and a nice thing for, teen, you know, children to learn. So if you take away the fun part and you focus on advertisements which talk about uh, a 10 year old kid being a crorepati crore because somebody just bought his app for a lot of money, that's sending the wrong message. As a parent, that's something I don't want my children to, you know, obsess about. And that's why I shared this review of White Hat Junior. I hope you like it. Do subscribe to my uh, YouTube channel and uh, let me know in the comments below what is your experience with online coding platforms and whether you have found good ones. Currently, my daughter is learning coding with uh, her own teacher. That's online too. And I will let you know if I find further platforms which help children learn better. Thank you for all.